Master of Practical Nurse Degree, Phi Theta Kappa, Army Wife. So today I finished my preceptor hour. Actually, I didn't finish it today. I finished it yesterday before I went to the fin finning, finning, pinning ceremony, and um, it was great. Yesterday was a little bit of a drama because, you know, what is nursing school without drama? Um, yeah, there's a little bit of a drama going on in our um, cohort yesterday, but it was all good. We all enjoyed the pinning ceremony yesterday. I had so much fun. So the pinning ceremony was great. I love it. It actually exceeds my expectation because um, it never happened in Bates history or in my school history that we did a formal event or a formal program during pinning ceremony. And after I saw past cohort spinning ceremony, I said to myself, um, I will not gonna have this thing happen. Our cohort decided to make it um, a little bit of a big event for us. including stage, nice venue, dessert table. Everyone is wearing same color dress. We have stalls, we have candles, and um, it was it was beautiful. <laughs> And I am so proud of them getting through and making it through um, all of the events that happened throughout their program. Okay, okay so about one year ago, um, we started this journey. You became nursing students in this fast-paced and challenging program, and I became a teacher. And I'll never forget this group of graduates because I feel like we started this journey together. And um, in fact, I think I was probably more nervous than you were last <laughs> September when I started being a teacher. Once, after a really particularly difficult test review in pharmacology, um, one of you left a really nice note from young <laughs> One of you sent me a very kind email. I was really touched by your kindness. Never lose that kindness. I don't really think I need this mic because I've never been accused of being quiet. Uh, my name is Bill Swartz. I am the only guy up here in this class. Uh, so I give special attention to the guys in the room because you can do it. So you guys have a lot to look forward to. Go forward. Um, so, thankfully I did, otherwise I would not be here today. 
My name is Meron. I'm a nursing student. Well, actually, you don't call me nursing student anymore because I am no longer a student. And <laughs> nursing school is going and I said nursing school is like driving you know riding a bike I'm pretty bad at riding bikes but um, it's like riding a bike but everything around it is on fire the bike is on fire the ground is on fire so the fact that we made it it's a big thing so congratulations class of 2019 Before I'm the only one who get a chance to pin Chad Douglas, but yesterday was the first time that he pinned me. And of course, he gotta have to do it the army way. I'm so proud because I get the chance to pin two of my classmates that day because they were right there but they didn't get a chance to cross the stage and get pinned by their loved ones but at the end of the program I saw them they were right there cheering for us at the back of the room and I believe it is important for everyone to get pinned so I saw two stalls that has pinned um, on the chair, I grab it, I grab them, and take them to stage and pin them as a nurse. Shout out to Dania, she's the one who organized everything. I'm so happy that I finished school, I'm, I'm done with school for now, but I'm going to keep going to get my RN, BSN, MSN, or doctorate. Who knows whatever I feel I'm gonna keep moving forward and um, you know continue with um, this journey I didn't tell you guys that I graduated I attended my graduation and I, I attended my painting ceremony a lot of my classmates don't want to attend graduation because graduation or the um, commencement commencement command commencement exercise commencements commencements what is commencements well the commencement exercise was back in may and we didn't we don't finish our program until august so a lot of my classmates didn't go and um, there's only 10 of us in our cohort attended the um, commencement exercise um maybe because you know they want to make sure that they finish before they cross the stage for graduation but for me if i don't do it this time when i'm going to do it the last time i crossed the stage was in high school that was back in 2012 no not 2012 was it 2012 no 2002 yeah well, it was back in 2002 and uh, that was a long time ago so um you know I was not going to lose anything if I'm going to attend to this um, graduation. Yeah, maybe I would jinx myself, but I think it other way around. Congratulations to the class of 2019. Instead of thinking of I'm going to jinx myself, I'm thinking it. it is actually a motivation for me to finish school. Manchester, practical nurse degree by Theta Kappa, Army Wife. So, what is my agenda for today? My agenda for today is go to school, start vlogging, because I miss vlogging. I haven't vlogged for since, um, I think I haven't vlogged since May. Although uh, my last upload was last June, I think it was June, but that vlogs are from April. So you're gonna be seeing a lot of um, back vlogs because I actually vlog while I'm in nursing school, but I don't get a chance to edit them and upload them on YouTube. 
because I finished my preceptor yesterday, I'm going to send back my preceptor packet, go to the veteran center to see if I have outstanding balance. So that way when they release our, what do you call this, um, certificate of completion, I am officially graduate and they can send it, they can send the certificate of completion to DOH and there will be no delays so that way I can sit on my NCLEX and get my license so that is um, my other goal right now is to to study for the NCLEX so that way I can get my license um, quick um, yeah and I'm going to return or donate my my old uniform to the next cohort there's no reason for me to to keep my my blueberry uniform look at this guys oh not the mess in my counter but look at this this is so cute Chad Douglas gave this to me yesterday he's very sweet guy I, I love Chad Douglas so much and look at this flowers I think he spent about freaking seventy dollars in that flowers and I'm told I told him hey Chad Douglas don't buy me flowers next time just buy me a plant those flowers are gonna die so instead of um, getting me flowers just buy me a, a pot of sun sunflower or or any other plant so that way you know like I can keep them alive for long all right so I'm heading out now, I'm going to school, and yeah, alright, I'll see you in school.